It's a beautiful day for another movie review. Hey, what's up? Kai here again. I'm here with my wonderful, beautiful girlfriend, Lisa, here again. XX meant to start XX. Hey, guys, what's up? And we're here to do a beautiful, wonderful, another beautiful, wonderful movie review in this in this wonderful neighborhood. Mm-hmm. And, um, and we just got to see a beautiful day in the neighborhood, a beautiful day in the... How's it go? Well, in the beautiful day in the neighborhood, won't you be, be my neighbor? neighbor? Yeah, we just got to see the new uh, Mr. Rogers movie, A Beautiful Day in the Neighborhood. and um, Starring Tom Hanks. Starring Tom Hanks as Mr. Rogers. And um, wonderful, wonderful movie. Mm -hmm. Sorry, we're talking so softly in this one. We're, we're, I mean, I'm glad. We're gonna talk softly in this one, and we're gonna have a nice, calm review this this today. Yeah. Because I, it was just, it's, it was just a, a wonderful movie, and I, te and I, this movie made me, I loved it so much. I grew up with Mr. Rogers so when I was a kid. So and, did I. And so did she, and um, it just was a wonderful, touching movie. I agree. I still have tears coming out of my eyes from the movie. I never. Watched. I never seen a movie where I teared up the whole movie, and uh, it was like definitely a tear jerker, and makes you, and it's just like makes you think, and it makes you really, like you know, it doesn't make you. Th I don't. Would you say it makes you think? Yes, it makes, makes you, you think. kind of think with your emotions. M emotions, yes. Kind of like it, kind of like Inside Out from Pixar. Yeah. Except I, I think this is like more a little more complex. Though. This is live action. Yeah, I'm just saying. But this was wonderful. Tom Hanks did a great job. As I agree, Mr. Rogers, and it's and it's really good. Mm -hmm. And uh, it's not a biography pick. I everyone thinks it's some people you might might watch just thinking it's a biography pick. No, it's 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 explain it like it's like. Basically, this movie is more. It's based on a true story, so it's some of it's sword. true. Yeah. So it's sort of like a biography, but it's not really not because mm. this is not like uh, what you be my neighbor from last year. That was a documentary of Mr. Rogers himself, and that got a PG-13 rating because of the dark subjects. Yeah, I, I like that documentary, but I thought this was a little actually ni nicer. And yeah, mellow. this is a little this more, is more mellow. Mellow and, P and this is PG rated. Yeah, thank God it got a PG rating. Yeah. But anyways, it should be rated G if you ask me. Yeah, but then again, because it's, it's like really for everybody this movie. Yeah, I agree. This should have got a G rating, but again, I can understand I why it's PG. Because I, of the, some of the topics. I guess so, yeah. I, I didn't see that many bad top, like, you know, just, like, you know, inappropriate topics. I didn't see that many. I mean, I guess when they drink, when they, when they have a, when the father and uh, Lloyd dr drink, drink together. Mm -hmm. Like, they drink a little, like, you know, alcohol. I guess, yeah. that's, I guess that's why it's PG. I don't know. Probably because of just, alcohol and language. There's really no, there's no language that there's much. No, there's no cussing. There's no cussing. There's no language. Very, this is the most sweetest movie I've seen all year. Me too. And one of them. Mm -hmm. And, um, t and what did you, what else do you think about it? What you, What's my thoughts about this? Yeah, what else is your thoughts about it? More opinions? I think this is a really beautiful movie. Everyone should at least go see it. I know. I think this is definitely one of those movies that I think it's gonna be like award contending. Yeah. This movie, I hope, will get nominated for I hope sure. Get an Oscar or a, is it Oscar or Academy Award? Well, right now, it right now it's the Oscars. It's the Oscars. Yeah. Oscars Either Oscar or Academy Awards. Something. Oscars uh, come up in February. Yeah. Let's hope this movie at least gets an honorable mention. An honorable mention or something. Yeah. Yeah. Let's just get. Let, let's just hope this movie gets like mentioned at least once. Yeah. Wait. And uh, tell what it's about. Anyways, it's about this reporter named Lloyd. I don't know who the actor who played him by, but he did yeah. like, a really good job. At first, I didn't think he was such a nice person. But then he kind of turns he around. He turns around, yeah. I it's think he like, was like kind of like his Mr. Rogers was being very nice to him, mm -hmm. and and he's kind of like a therapist. Yeah. And he was, and he wasn't acting like 
just he was acting kind of out of rage and like had anger problems and mm-hmm. and stuff. But you tell whether like you know Lloyd Lloyd had anger problems and like some like family stress in his family and like mm-hmm. you know. But it but you tell it ends up very happy and you yes. tell the rest of what it is, what happens. And then made a match. Uh, he meets. He gets a job from his reporter company that. He should interview Mr. Rogers yeah. to be like part of his like article, and mm-hmm. and this is actually based on an article. What makes a hero? Yeah. And this is like a complex like storyline or essay about how we use our feelings to deal with the anger or exactly. sadness or whatever. And he writes, and he and he and Lloyd and Mr. Rogers become friends, and it's a beautiful relationship. And, and it's a beautiful day in the neighborhood. Exactly. And he and Mr. Well, Mr. Roger has helped him at first, but Lloyd's a little bit hesitant because he's technically a radio, a TV show host yeah. from a children's show. But it, it, you've seen all you all seen the children's show when you were a kid, I'm sure. Yeah, and it's, it's one of my favorite shows. It was on like on PBS or something. I think. Yeah, it was on PBS. PBS Kids or something. Oh no. I were like in the morning, like early in the morning. It was like ten o'clock in the morning or six o'clock. I can't remember. It was six o'clock but at when night. When did I come out? Like in the seventies or like started Starting in the sixties? Yeah, something? it started in the sixties. I have to look that up when I have to look that information up. But mm-hmm. uh, I can't. T- I, I yeah, I think it was either sixties or seventies started. Sixties. And it ended in uh, two thousand and one. Two thousand yeah, around two thousand because of his death and stuff. Yeah, he passed but. away and and. It's really sad. I just really wanted to meet him. Meet him because I I was I was like I was a big fan. I'm a big fan of I was a big fan of his. Me too. And I just really, it's just really upsetting. Yeah. Died of what did he die from? I don't know. If you guys like, like cancer no, or something. I think cancer or illness. I have illness, no idea. Yeah, it's really sad. It was sad that Mr. Rogers died indeed. Yeah. But I think this movie is beautiful. But he was very young, wasn't he? I have no idea. Yeah, anyways, what were you saying? This movie, in the end, was really beautiful. Everyone should at least go see it. I was crying a little bit during the, during the movie myself. Me too. It's okay. But yeah. in the end, though, everyone, especially Tom Hanks, did an excellent, excellent, excellent job portraying. Excellent, wonderful, amazing job. Outstanding, <laughs> excellent, amazing, fantastic, great, mm-hmm. everything you can think of. Beautiful. A beautiful movie indeed. Beautiful movie indeed. Beautiful day in the neighborhood. Mm -hmm. And yeah, in the end, everyone should at least give this movie a watch. Definitely watch this. And uh, let's let's, uh, talk about the rate. Let's get down to the ratings. 10 out of 10. 10 out of 10. Very, very good. And I was very surprised on how good this was going to be. I knew it was going to be good. I didn't think it was going to be like a... like this like like this this was like a whole experience new experience for me mm. and i want to talk about lloyd a little bit more you know what this character reminded me of a little bit he reminded oh. me of um oh. i forgot that one guy but i know bradley cooper played a similar man in silver linings yes i never seen that movie but i want to check it out yeah i've seen bits and pieces of it basically yeah i don't give in too much of that movie but lloyd will remind you of that guy from silver linings playbook the one played by Mary, the one played by Bradley Cooper, and I know who starring. Um, I forgot her name. Cat. I forgot, but I know she was the lady who played Katniss in mm-hmm. Hunger Games. Yeah. I forgot her name, but but they know the co-star. But anyways, this movie, go see it right. Beautiful. Go see it right away. It's go see it in the nearest theater or wherever it's playing. It's a very beautiful movie. Yeah. It'll, it'll make you think. It'll make you remember childhood from Mr. Rogers. And there's a lot of Mr. Rogers Easter eggs. Yeah, and there's stuff at the end that you guys like in the stage end, or in the, the credits. Beginning, in the ending credits, and um, also he does like the show in the movie and like mm-hmm. other, based on the show. Yeah, the it's show. really and I, I didn't expect that. Like, that was so cool how we did the opening. And and, the opening and everything was amazing. The font that the movie looked like was very great. I don't want to give too much away, but. Mm. But there's a lot of Mr. Rogers Easter eggs. Yeah. Like a lot of Easter eggs. And. and, and it kind of, you know, why also maybe jerk, tear, maybe cry a little bit. Why? Because my, th- I never announced this on my channel. My old psychiatrist had w- passed away, mm-hmm. and he was just like Mister Rogers. He looked like Mister Rogers, and he looked like he just 
reminded me he was a he was a, you know a psychiatrist slash therapist uh-huh. and i was so close to him so close and that's who he reminds me of like you know my old my old psychiatrist from uh suffered suffered new york mm-hmm. yeah Aww. rest in peace dr fogelman and rest in peace, Mr. Rogers. And rest in peace, Mr. Rogers. This, this, video is de- for you, for you. this video is dedicated to you. For, you, for both of you. Yes. And and Mr. Rogers. Mm-hmm. Um, so, yeah, what would you say? 10 out of 10? 10 out of 10. 10 out of 10. Very good movie. Definitely go see it. I, if, if you love... If you love Mr. Rogers, and you'll and you and you'll definitely you'll definitely cr- te- you'll definitely cry throughout a lot of the movie, mm-hmm. and um, it's just a, a touching, very amazing movie. I can go I can go on all day about all night about this, mm-hmm. but it's just amazing. Definitely check it out. I agree. Yeah. Anyway, though, guys, hope you enjoyed this movie that we did. Thanks a lot for watching, for subscribing. Definitely give us a thumbs up. Leave a comment below. Please rate, subscribe. And um, check out my girlfriend on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter, and Tumblr. Follow her on Instagram and t- Tumblr and Twitter and 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 Facebook. And, and face add her on Facebook. Subscribe to her XX Mental Star XX on YouTube. And and on MeWe. And on MeWe. New episode review coming up this week. I don't know if it's gonna be a Thanksgiving episode, uh, but of South Park. Yeah. yeah. Let's just hope it's another not. Let's just hope it's not integrity. Let's just hold Mountain State and Trey Parker are not going to be trolling us with another. Let's do a Integrity Forms Thanksgiving special. Right. But in the end, though, I don't think it really matters. But to all of you, happy Thanksgiving. Happy Thanksgiving. Hope happy all- holidays. What yeah. were you going to say? I was going to say, um, I think this is a very beautiful Thanksgiving movie. Yeah. It's just definitely fell around the right time for family to get together. Yeah. And and uh, happy Thanksgiving, everyone! Thanks a lot for watching, for subscribing. Uh, more vid- more videos and more reviews on the way to come, and more vi- videos and stuff. So definitely give this video a thumbs up, and uh, hope you all have a wonderful, beautiful day or night in your neighborhood. In your neighborhood, beautiful day in the neighborhood. It's a beautiful day in the neighborhood. neighborhood. A beautiful, beautiful day. day. That won't you be my neighbor? Peace. Bye, everyone.